So in today's video, I just wanted to do a quick um, review and um, viewing of um, this limited edition sneaker, Nike by You. I purchased um, over the week. Um, so right now, um, this is one of two pairs that is going to come. Um, this happens to be an Air Max 90. Um, so a little bit about the history of the Air Max 90. Um, it was created as like um, a sequel to um, the Air Max 1 or the Air Max Trainer 1 waffle. Um, it didn't really have much... Um, feature so they wanted to try the air max bubble um with a little bit of more um protection on the shoe um so this was about the same time they dropped the air max one um this was a little bit larger um air bubble um for dynamics um so right now the hype is like dunks everybody knows there's dunks so um this is one of two shoes i'm iding i custom um it finally came today. It was patience, but it came. Um, just gonna show you the shoe. Um, give you a little info on it. Um, as you can see the box. Um, it's a white box. Um, so the hype is with like um, the dunks. Um, they're bringing back a lot of the old school dunks. Um, and people are trying to, you know, um, I don't know how you say, like, um, collect dunks again. But they're bringing back, like, different silhouettes of the old versions. And people are bringing back the old um, dunks that uh, were popular back in the days. Um, so um, the originals are always going to be different. Um, so some of the originals I couldn't get. If you watch my videos, you'll see my sneaker collections, and I've been collecting for a while. Um, some of the shoes I I want to collect right now that are just too old, so I can't get them because they'll just they're not wearable. So I had to just kind of remake or find a new versions of them. So um, this shoe is um a lot of hype around it. It's um the Futura Air Max um id for mother's day um so i kind of based it off of the flom for love or money dunk um reason why i couldn't get that done because it's just too old and it's no point of paying that much for a shoe that's not sustainable material and wearable so i just created my own with the futura um pattern so um a little bit about this shoe um it came from um Futura Laboratories, um, it was a specific type of dunk with currency um, all over the print. Um, uh, it was a, it was exclusive to a certain amount of pairs. Um, of course, Futura, the graffiti artist uh, who created the shoe, um, had a collaboration with Nike. Um, the shoe he created was kind of like similar to these colorways um a little bit of history on the dunk um from what i know it just is a graffiti artist shoe um there was certain silhouettes of it different color variations and samples so i kind of just took my own idea put it in this air max id um so you see in the box you see the box it comes in um it came with the dust bag so right now you could customize these on Nike ID. If you go under Women's Air Max 90, um, you'll see it's at the very bottom. Pretty cool. Came with the dust bag, which I will use to protect my shoe. Um, so let's get into the shoe. So um, what I basically did is uh, kind of base it off the, um, the currency on the Futura Flam um, dunk. So you see we got this um, mesh material here. Of like um, the C note um, blue um, hundred dollar bill sign um, colors. Um, so I, I I took that color um, for the base. I put a little bit of um, this snake skin pink um, for the um, 
money currency in um, England or London from Elizabeth, Queen Elizabeth. Um, then I took a little bit of like gray from um, Fitcher's actual like um, base color of a lot of his um, shoes and like um, currency shades of um, currency, old currency. Then you got this black um, snake upper. It's a gloss black for like um, the dunk, the dark dunk colors of the stitching. Um, I put purple in there too, just for the colorways of the dunk. Um, and then the blue also for like the colorways of the dunk. Um, added um, white, white up top too for like the currency um, American dollar because you know it's printed on white paper. Um, I put the silver, the silver um, color for, um, you know, the dollar bill or the money, money currency. Um, then I went with just like a basic, um, the white base um, color just for the, um, the currency for the, the money, American um, money print color is white. Then I got these tans and these blues for like European money currency colors. Um, and then it lets you customize um, the the back of the shoe um, with some letters. So I put zero and then an L F. So for like a reverse um, for the love um, of money. So it's like a reversed. Um, and then this one also, it's a zero and then an L and F for um, for future love of our our um, laboratory, Futura, which is like his brand. It also comes with a little keychain, um, Air Max keychain, um, with like a graffiti style letter, Futura. The insole, the inserts have like a graffiti style Nike Air. Um, it's a pretty dope shoe. It came with a little bit of graphics. I didn't realize that was gonna come on. Um, the snakeskin, um, basically overall, it's an Air Max 90, um, Air Max 90, um, Futura, uh, Mother's Day, um, so this is a women's size 12, so it's a 10 and a half, which would fit me, um, anything, um, smaller, I wouldn't be able to fit, I just, I won't, I don't wear a, a smaller size, so, um, it's a pretty dope shoe, as you can see, you got the whole, um, um, currency color pattern on this one. So, there you have it, the uh, Futura um, Air Max 90 ID with the um, Flom currency colorway. So, um, I'll be expecting another shoe. It's um, an ID. Um, I don't want to tell you what it is until I, I get it, but I'll, I'll show that one as soon as it comes in.